Yo, -ho, I want to thank everybody for 800,000 subscribers. That is absolutely insane. I remember when we had our first thousand back in the day and we were playing Ultimate Tower Defense. I know, it's wild, right? So today, we're going to be taking a look at all of the new code units coming to All-Star Tower Defense. But before we do, I need you guys to comment down below what you want my next code unit to be. I'm going to work with the developers and we're going to set up the next sub goal. Um, I know we're close to 1 million subs, so maybe we'll do something special for that or 900k. Let me know down below and then comment down below who you think would be a great code unit. All right, let's quickly go over my old code units and then we're going to go take a look at um, all of the new units coming to the game ASAP. All right, we actually have a few YouTubers that just reached the milestones to get codes. So uh, we got a lot of stuff to look forward to. If you guys don't know way back, Mrs. Love, guys, that right there, she was my OG code unit. Yes, sir. She hasn't even been reskinned yet, which is kind of crazy, but neither has the other one. And then after that, we had the one and only Zero Two, who actually is ridiculously powerful. Like, um, uh, look at those stats. That is absolutely cracked. And um, uh, then after Taco, we had the one and only Toru Dragon Maid. All right, Dragon Maid was pretty good. And then lastly, we had um, uh, Emperor Handgun. All right, we had Whole Horse. So uh, who should we make next in the list? I know we kind of broke the cycle. So should we go with another waifu or should we stick to a male character? All right, if you guys don't know, I actually drew the face for this guy. So uh, that is my first official contribution to ASTD. So let's go take a look at the other code units and uh, let's go. So first up, guys, King Luffy is back. And yes, guys, he did actually hit that 400K. So uh, he just posted this video yesterday saying that um, uh, um, uh, his new code unit is dropping soon. And it's supposed to be Wano Mihawk. So uh, I'm pretty excited for that. He showed it off in a few videos. So comment down below when do you think um, King Luffy's new code unit is dropping. It looks like he already did all the special effects, etc. So like, I'm really hoping this thing can drop soon because it looks like he's been cooking on uh, Zoro for a while. So I really feel like he can get it popping off and uh, knock this unit out pretty quickly. So I hope Navy approves of everything and uh, we can get that uh, code unit popping. And we're still waiting guys for the Handgun Emperor Blessing. So uh, still can't believe that hasn't dropped. And he even put in the work guys. Look at the Blessing man, bro. If this unit actually drops soon, this is going to be insanely hype. This is probably the most hype code unit ever added to the game. So I really hope we can actually get that added because I was hoping it was going to be added four months ago, but hopefully uh, King Luffy actually gets it popping very soon. I'm very hyped for that. And we got another one as well, guys, for my boy Day Day, the king of ASTD. We got um, uh, Pizza Girl. So uh, she's going to be pretty hyped coming to the game. Now, Day Day says she is kind of being worked on, sort of. So uh, she is already kind of being worked on. So hopefully she drops soon. Um, but I know uh, Day Day hit 100K a long time ago. So I'm hoping they can uh, finish up her code units. And then I also want to give another big congratulations to one of my good friends, guys. Admin TV. He just hit 100K subscribers. So a big shout out to him. He's an absolute legend. And uh, I'm hoping he's able to get a code unit soon. Uh, I'm going to try to help him out and get that popping off. But uh, I can't wait for that as well. So thank you guys again for 800K. Comment down below what my next code unit should be. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.